Hi, welcome to Deja Vu Tarot. I am back with another reading. We are going to just um, basically pull some from my regular tarot deck. Also, we have the Angels and Ancestors Oracle cards. So I'm going to pull a few of these. It says Guardian of the Four Corners, Mother in the Earth, Father in the Sky, Angels and Ancestors. Take your horns. I call on you and welcome you now. So give me the messages for the collective. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you all who have done so. Continue to watch. Again, I am a seer. Take what resonates, please leave the, the rest. I am a seer, so some of this may have not even been registered yet. Make sure y'all save these videos. Come back to it if it does, okay? All right, let's get... Let's get two good cards from your ancestors, angels. We got fire guardian. And one more spirit. Again, thank y'all who's been liking and watching. I hope this message resonates. Holy Spirit, can I get one more, please? That's a lot. <laughs> One more. We got Fire Garden. Fire Garden. Fire Guardian. Look what came out. The sun. And I take one more. Ego. Enjoy success and happiness and see from a higher perspective. Okay. Ignite your passions is what I was trying to say. And then I said fire garden. So some of y'all may like to grow. You may have a garden. Unleash the wild within. Bottom of the deck. Trust and thrive. Okay, so we got fire guardian. Ignite the passion within. Sun. And ego. See from a higher perspective. So let's just see what these... <clears throat> Right away, it's like, what I'm feeling is take hold of your passions and go for it. Stay positive. It is success in whatever you are passionate about. And also seek from a higher perspective, right? So what seems to be not going well for you today doesn't mean in the future it's going to do the same. Um, get a higher perspective of what you're doing. So y'all could be definitely magicians, what I do, tarot readers or... Um, you may do some type of business where you perform, okay? Could be a twin flame I'm talking to. Some of y'all are practitioners, uh, tarot readers, magicians. Uh, see from a higher perspective, Spirit is saying, okay? Well, this is maybe what y'all need to do. Start your passions into spiritual work. Garden, this looked like a garden to me. That's what I was saying. Somebody may do herbs or they have a garden. Go ahead and work on that garden, okay? It's gonna, it's definitely going to be a success here. You could be a uh, herbalist or something like that. You want to get a business started. It's success in it with the sun card. You're gonna soar with the ego. All right, let's look up Fire Garden first. Um, you know what? I do want to get some Zodiacs. I'm just feeling led to maybe grab some Zodiacs. This may resonate. It may not. Take what resonates. And leave the rest. I feel like you are building, working on a project here. Collaborating, you may have some coworkers, somebody you're working with and you just, the vibe is not there, you want good vibes. You're fighting, Mars, okay. So you're, you're, you're arguing with these people. You're part of some group or maybe your business, 
We got fire at the bottom. So you definitely could be a fire sign. We got two fire cars. Somebody's mad over what you do. Look, the sun. That's crazy. Look at that. Anytime I get two confirmations in my, with two different decks, that's a confirmation for you. So whoever I'm talking to, maybe somebody's mad over what you do for your business. You may have a spiritual business, herbal business. You may be a psychic. All of a sudden, my throat. Thirsty, thirsty hoes. Some uh, maybe this is your desire. Somebody's very thirsty. You could be a divine feminine. I'm talking to same sex couple. Your identity. You could be hiding your identity as a psychic. I don't know. Or maybe something like that I'm picking up. <clears throat> well, furthermore, ignite your passion. So it's something that you could be fighting. When Neptune talks about the psychic psyche, you could be fighting your mind, your thoughts. Maybe you're thinking about it a lot. Let's just get some zodiacs. Holy Spirit, what's some zodiacs to this? Now, granted, it could be all of y'all if your zodiac don't come out, but these are all confirmations, okay? We got cancer. We all have these zodiacs in our chart, but these could be specific people that I'm talking to. This could be confirmation for you. This could be your cross watcher, your family member. We got Aries, so we have fire sign on the board. Capricorn. And Leo. Okay. Earth, fire, and water. Okay. Getting some lessons, eh? That's what she said. Somebody is getting lessons, learning their lessons. What they're getting out, they're getting back. You got to see it from a higher perspective. We have Mars on the board. So definitely they could be fighting amongst themselves. It'll be a community, a group. We got the three of pentacles. Talk about working together as a group, a, a society. Could be a group of magicians here. Working together here to fight you, collector. Or emperor. Because you next. Well, they could be males. Like a group of male men. They're getting some lessons, though. Also, this could be your cross watcher. You, you could... Be getting lessons right now. Possibly friends, family. You may be fighting with a lot of people. And spirit is trying to lead you to make a decision to. Because I got the king of swords. Which talk about cut that bitch off. That's my cut the bitch off card. So emperor you may be needing to make a decision here. Or who you're going to cut. Or the decision to move on. So these could be people you sleeping with. Or you were being a player too you don't want to be a player no more because you got somebody else in mind you watching someone else okay you ready to live in your truth and maybe you went through a divorce or something that was really not good for you here you don't want to hold back no more you sick of like worrying and having all this stress and Wherever you went, you're, you're not satisfied. So this could be male or female here. You want a union. Okay, you want a union. I I can't make That's it what up. she said. You want to be happy with the sun card twice on the board? You want to be happy. You're looking at it now from a higher perspective here. You don't want these childish relationships anymore. You're sick of these childish relationships. You want something that will be celebratory that will have good vibes only okay you want good vibes only you don't want all these towers and drama we have the five of swords somebody is sick of fighting and like because they're under judgment and what i say they sick they weak so this could be a group of magicians getting bad karma or your person here 
The towers are all reversed. And they sick of it. Yeah, they want something more loyal, more stable. Okay. Now they reminiscing. They like, man, I do want my family. I want my family back. Okay. Could be seeing you collected. Being balanced and living in your truth, you know. You may be more spiritual. He may want to come offer something to you, you know. That's switching to a different energy. It could be the same energy. I'm not for sure. But let's keep moving. So Fire Garden says connect with your desires, okay. Sparks could lead to something very beautiful here. Um, the Fire Garden represents the angel of fire. It's energy that many people are afraid of but shouldn't be. Burning desires could lead to great expansion. So Spirit is saying, call on the fire angel and to allow that fire guardian to help you. Awaken your wild, wild, wilder side. So some of y'all could be a little bit um, closed-minded or maybe you're, uh, what's the word? Conservative. And Spirit is saying, you need to call on the fire guardian angel to help you tap into your wild side it says when this card appears you are reminded th reminded that passion is powerful and absolutely encouraged by spirit so passion okay passion get into that fire passion it says you are being guided by your angels to connect with powerful energy of desire if you have recently set an intention to explore your sexual side become more sexually open the fire of desire can burn away any old setbacks that are preventing you from expressing that part of your nature. If you are in a relationship, this card is indicated a great spiritual sexual connection is on the way. What I'm saying here. That's what she said. What am I saying? I told you this person is tired of whatever they're at. Could be a Libra. I see Libra here. This person want to be single. Okay. So, y'all definitely got some unions coming up on the horizon. But with the Mars here, Mars could just be like, this person is trying to fight this passion so much. They're trying to fight it. We got fired twice. So, this is confirmation. This person is sexually attracted to you. They think about you all the time. You make them happy with the two sun cards, two different decks, right? You make them happy. That's what I was saying, like, they see you as the one, like you are their destined partner. They've made a decision. There's none like you. You are a child of God, okay? They see that, Ra, two confirmations. God, already in the reading, okay. Oh, sun. Yeah, we're going to... I was just about to jump into tarot. Let's see. Let's do the sun. Sun. Here we go. Happiness. Okay, so it says, not, know that doors are opening for you guys. Follow up new projects, ventures, and ideas. Connect with the inner fire that has driven you forward. The sun has long been associated with the energy of success. Amen. It's the most powerful planet in the solar system. Solar referring to sun. Of course, when the sun card appears in a reading, it will bring power, success, and light to you. It brightens up all connections, banishes darkness, brings a sense of usefulness, and invites you to connect to the energy of joy so that you could be light in spirit and in heart. You are being surrounded by the brightness of the sun at this time. Opportunities to feel and be successful are swirling and dancing around you. And you feel happy and uplifted. You're not somewhere bright. If you're not somewhere bright and sunny right now, there will be other ways in which you can enjoy warmth and joy. Solar energy brings health and vitality and can energize and warm. And it also encourages everything to grow. The energy of expansion is with you at this time, and you'll be offered the perfect opportunity to move forward. If you want to bring something to life or ready to take a new step, 
The sun will bring that right energy to you. If you are asking the question, it's definitely yes. So again, another confirmation collective to take that leap. Whatever you're passionate about, whatever you're fighting right now, take that leap. God got your back. Look at that. God got your back. God, son, Ra. Okay. Got your back twice in the reading. Wow, this is good, guys. Look at here. Romance. Exactly. Because this person is. This person. This person is slaying demons, honey. Cutting cords. Getting people out of their life that do not serve them. Because they want you. Yeah. Yeah. This person. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, look at here. That's what she said. Your amper. Okay. This person is crazy as hell about you. I'm telling you, Neptune is on the board. I told you, psychosis. This person is definitely crazy about you also. This person, now I'm not going to lie, they could have been a part of some type of crazy sex cult. Okay, doing some type of dark spell working things. But I feel like they're not with that no more, okay? They're, they're realizing they want real true romance. Okay, it says, I am the good shepherd, the good shepherd giving his life for his sheep. John 10, 11. Okay, so ranking up. Let me upgrade you. Okay, so spirit is saying, God is saying, God is taking care of him. This person is ranking up and this person is going to speak up. Okay. Don't let you try to stop you, Collective. The answer need to be yes, Spirit is saying. God is saying yes, this person is going to be trustworthy when you when he, this person come back. Or yes, go ahead and start that romance. Or yes, go ahead and be you. Okay. And do that project. Choose that new love. Okay. Some of y'all, these are your enemies. I ain't gonna lie. Take y'all pick. If these people been doing rituals and things, it's pretty saying that's some dumb shit. Don't let these people back in your life. Okay. If you cut these people out, there is still a chance for you. Okay. These people are dumb. That was dumb shit you did too, but it is still a chance. For you, collecting, if you get out of these groups and things, okay? Because love is what you need. So maybe you don't think you need love. Yes, you do. This is confirmation for you. Love is what you need. Romance is here for you. Okay? This person is leveling up. God is taking care of you and this person, and they'll eventually speak up. Okay? But they gotta cut cords first, okay? Now, I will say because we got Mars, Neptune on the board, people that's been fighting these demons and things, all right, they're getting karma. People that was involved in these sex cults and was doing magic, okay? They're crazy now, Spirit saying it's it in reverse, okay? So they're crazy now. So the only thing that's gonna stop you this time collective is you don't let you stop you that's what she said god saying it's gonna be clear you gotta see it from a higher perspective this person was yeah they was doing a lot yeah they needed to pay off this this debt they ran as far as whatever the debt was yeah because they didn't quit. These people just kept going, kept going, kept going. It says rest. So some of y'all may need to take a rest. You're moving too fast. 
There's none like you. This person is resting. This person is thinking now. This person is meditating and trying to figure out, yeah, fix it. Jesus is going to fix it. Ask God to fix it for you, right? You could have done this. And so your message is, is getting fixed. Don't quit. Keep the faith. See it from a higher perspective. Understand these karmics didn't fill up their cup. So they got with your person. This person probably didn't have no cup. He didn't, they didn't know what love is yes, these these karmas trying to stop your person your emperor from coming okay but the angels were protecting you you had to cut cords and he had to cut his cords right it's a process definitely talking to an air sign court date hearing so this person could be having a lot of legal issues so whoever this masculine is they definitely going through it just give me my money. Yeah, they going through it. They put all oh, the courts. Don't talk about it. Be about it. And we got rest again. So that's what I'm saying. This person could be meditating, resting. Or this person is feel like you going to be the rest collective. Like, if this person come back, okay. We got Florida. If this person come back.